Alright. I'm back. LTL Editorial News. Happy New Year. Maybe. Well, the next story, as I promised my brothers and sisters in Nigeria, my friends in Nigeria, here's your story about Boko Haram. Now, last year I brought up about Boko Haram and what they was doing. And are they the new terrorist group? You know, last year, Al-Shabaab was the talk of terrorism in Somalia. That they had to have the Kenyan Defense Force to go over there and shut them up. Now, you got Boko Haram. Boko Haram started blowing up vehicles in the northeast area of Nigeria. Uh, so much killing people. And now, on well before then, Christmas Day, they blew up a church, killing 40 people, and then afterwards blew up from vehicles, and then, of course, the beginning of the year, blew up a couple more churches. Now, what did this tell you about Boko Haram? Yes, Boko Haram may be the new terrorist group, but they all picking up on frustration. Of course, there's a lot of frustration in Africa because social economics does play a part. If you don't believe me, as Southern Sudan now, who's uh, having tribal fights, which run people in bushes. And then, really, the other situation that is going on in the DRC, still some killings going on. And secretly, in Senegal, there's some things happening there. Now, because of the social economics and other problems, really, the the real reason why Boko Haram is starting wars or starting where they blowing up churches it's not a Christian Muslim situation because really Al Qazir brought it up on the listening post with Richard Gisbert to where he talked about if you look at the land of Nigeria in the north is really drying up to where the land is becoming sand and is there's no growth there so you have uh, Muslims which is predominantly uh, Muslims up there to come further south and they need homes so and land so they take over because of frustration and then a group was formed Boko Haram really Boko Haram was listening to the teachings of fundamentalists from like Afghanistan and Yemen well the teachings of Osama bin Laden and Iraqi and so that's why they pick up on it they pick up on it just like Al Shabaab so of course they're gonna learn that too because really the key point is they sick and tired of the Western countries trying to dictate and try to come 
into Africa teaching the fundamentals. That's why Afghanistan uh, had the problem with and Taliban was formed. Afghanistan, Pakistan, you might as well say Iran, Iraq, because of the Western countries. So the key things are that why Boko Haram are very upset is the Western teaching. They're not blowing up the churches because it's Christian. They blowing up even the uh, Muslims area. Even the homes. It's just the part they are frustrated. It's not the Christian Muslim religion. It is about the Western culture. That's what it is. From the Western countries trying to teach it and install it onto them. And it's due to the Afghanistan and Pakistan and Yemen fundamental teachings that is causing them to rebel. And plus, social economics does play a role. That's the real truth. I'll be back. I'm going to tell about Nigeria again based on the fuel and what's going down. On the LTL editorial news, fuel strike in Nigeria. Coming up next.